いこうなった教えてくれるのかえ嫌だけどえあの悪夢みたいな一学期期末を経験した後で Welcome, my fellow weebs and otakus. Having a fun day today? Don't worry. We're here to make it even better. Because today, we're giving an insight into who are the voice actors and actresses behind our favorite haiku characters. So, sit back and relax as we go over the voiceovers of our favorite haiku characters. And if you want a part two to this, then you know what to do. And don't worry, no spoiler alerts will spring up, and only Japanese. Voiceovers will be in this video. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start. First in, number 15, is Yuki Kaji. We are here to start with a voice for our dead inside and introverted Kenma Kozume. Kenma Kozume is everyone's favorite introvert player of the Nekomo High team, and his Japanese voice actor just smothers that butter over his personality. His Japanese voice is by Yuki Kaji, who is known for his notable voiceovers of a ton of main characters, such as Eren from Attack on Titan, Ko from Ao Haru Ride, Todoroki from Boku no Hero Academia, and even Yoto from Hentai Prince and the Stone Faced Cat. Yuki Kaji Has also received numerous awards before his role as Kenma Kozume and has been voice acting since 2004. He's currently married at the age of 35. Next up on number 14 is Hino Satoshi. Satoshi Hino is the voice actor of our soft, tough guy and Karasuno High Captain, Daichi Sawamura. And with that deep and gentle voice, he has certainly voiced a good amount of characters. Satoshi Hino is well known for his supporting roles and a few main character voiceovers, one of which are Ainz from Overlord, Saito from The Familiar of Zero, and Yuji from Shakugan no Shana. His most notable and latest one is Rengoku from Demon Slayer, which we all love. Now, Satoshi Hino has been doing voice acting since 2000. One and is currently married at the age of 42. Next on the list is number 13, Nobuhiko Okamoto. The next character voice actor is for Nishinoya Nu, who, as we all know, is just a comedic character that everyone needed. Plus, he's a libero, and he even has an amazing voice actor, Nobuhiko Okamoto. Nobuhiko Okamoto is the voice actor behind amazing characters that we all know and love. And these characters are Karma from Assassination Classroom, Usui from Maid Sama, and even Bakugo from Hero Academia. He just has that charisma that draws us in. And his way of portraying these characters. Characters is what makes us love this guy. Nobuhiko Okamoto has been voice acting since 2005 and is currently married at the age of 34. Next up on number 12 is Mio Iruno. Mio Iruno is the voice behind a mix of a five year old child and a proud mom and a funny aunt, which is Sugawara Koshi. Mio Iruno has done his voice with Sugawara Koshi that every girl that watched Haikyu immediately felt like marrying him. Not only that, Mio Iruno is also the voice of numerous memorable characters, such as Ishida from Silent Voice, Jintan from Secret Base, Takao from Garden of Words, and many, many more. Mio Iruno is renowned for his sincere voice acting and his positive. Attitude, thus, his roles in dramatic animes that gave us a ton of teary moments. He is currently single and living happily at the age of 32. <laughs> Moving on to number 11 is Kaori Nazuka. <laughs> If you want a voice actress that voices waifu material characters, then look no further. Because the voice behind our sweet and innocent team manager, Kyoko Shimizu, is none other than Kaori Nazuka. Kaori Nazuka has also voiced memorable female characters such as Chelsea from Akami Ga Kill, Sukasa from Amagami SS, and even you and Toru from My Hero Academia. She may not have the virgin killing voice, but she does have the killer mature voice. On top of that, Kaori Nazuka is a wonderful woman with The child at the age of 36. Now we're on number 10, Hayashi Yu. 
For our next character on Haikyuu, it would be Ryunosuke Tanaka, our delinquently baldy that is in deep love with an innocent girl. And who's the better voice actor for that other than Hayashi Yu? Hayashi voiced Ryunosuke perfectly and has voiced numerous anime characters like Brown Smoke from Jojo or even Miyabi from Love Live, and also the voice actor for Manjiro in the newest anime who has voiced numerous anime characters, Tokyo Revengers. Though Hayashi Yu isn't as prominent as other voice actors are, however, he is the vocalist for most OPs you can hear from Food Wars and Bungo Stray Dogs. He is currently 38 with a voice acting career since 2003. Next up is number 9, Tanaka Kazunari. Tanaka Kazunari is the wonderful voice behind our ever-loving and strict Karasuno coach, Keishin Okai. Tanaka Kazunari is one of the top choices when it comes to portraying an uncle type of character, and fair enough, he has voiced a fair amount of those characters, such as Kishimoto from Slam Dunk, a ton of characters from One Piece, and another ton for Detective Conan. Tanaka Kazunari was an outstanding voice actor that even voiced in our favorite video games, such as Metal Gear solid too. Sadly, Tanaka Kazunari has passed away at the age of 49 due to a brain hemorrhage and Keishin Oka's voice actor switched to Hisao Egawa. On our number 8 is Soma Saito. <laughs> The voice behind the protagonist-like character that we all love but fully know that he's weak and useless. Tadashi Yamaguchi is Soma Saito. Soma Saito is best known for his voice acting for characters such as Tanaka from Odd Taxi, Tatsumi from Akamika Kill, and even the current protagonist of Handshakers. He has also done a ton of openings for multiple animes and is a gifted singer. He even voices Tadashi Yamaguchi perfectly. He's currently 30 years old and has been voice acting since 2010. We're now on number 7, Toshiki Masuda. Moving on to our husbando zone again is everyone's reserved and bold, Chika Inoshita, who may be the voice behind our underrated character? Well, the answer to that is Toshiki Masuda. Toshiki Masuda is a singing voice actor who has voiced numerous anime characters, one of which is Toranosuke from Yamada-kun to Seven Witches and Eijiro from My Hero Academia. He's also responsible for a ton of openings for animes he has voiced in. He's known for his subtle but cheerful voice acting. Acting, and he's currently 30 years old and has been voice acting since 2009. Moving on to number 6, Hosoya Yoshimasa. <laughs> We've gotten to the great guy who voices our big gentle bear, Asahi Azumane. And if you're going to ask about what's great about the guy, then let me tell you. Hosoya Yoshimasa has been a long-running voice actor who has voiced a ton of our favorite anime characters. And a few examples of that are Reiner from Attack on Titan, Orga from Iron-Blooded Orphans, and even Fumikage from My Hero Academia. This guy has succeeded in being one of the best supporting voice actors. You just have to give it to him because of how good he can be at putting color to his characters and even putting love onto our Asahi. He's been voice acting since 2002 and is currently 39 years old. <laughs> Next up on number 5 is Asami Seto. Our next entry is our beautiful Asami Seto, who is voicing our irritatingly lovable girl from Haikyuu, Yui Michinimiya. Asami Seto is an extremely talented voice actress that has voiced most of our favorite waifus. And a few examples of these are Raftalia from The Rising of the Shield Hero, My Senpai from Bunny Girl Senpai, and Nobara from Jujutsu Kaisen. It would be hard to believe this, but Yui Michinimiya is just one of more than 50 characters that Asami Seto has voiced. She's also currently 28 and only started voice acting in 2011 with her first major role as Yoshino Takatsuki from Wandering Sun. Landing onto our number 4 is Yuichi Nakamura. This guy, this guy is a top dog voice actor 
and he's currently voicing the character that everyone is fangirling about. It's Tetsuro Kuro. And if you don't consider Tetsuro's voice as sexy, then damn it. Yuichi Nakamura is nothing short of being the best because he has roles that everyone knows and loves, such as Gojo from Jujutsu Kaisen, Tatsuya from The Irregular at Magic High School, Reinhardt from RE0, and a ton of other memorable roles. No wonder Tetsuro is such as Thirst King in Haikyuu. Yuichi Nakamura is the ace at creating chick magnet characters and has been one of the top running voice actors in these two decades and he is surprisingly 40 years old. Getting to number 3 is Koki Ichimiya. <laughs> If we're going back into talking into protagonist roles, then we can't miss out on the sexy and attracting voice of Kei Tsukishima's voice actor, which is, you've guessed it, Koki Ichimiya. Koki Ichimiya has mastered the art of voicing for fangirls. This guy has unforgettable characters such as Seiya from Agami Brilliant Park, Yu from Charlotte, not Yu, Yu, or even Ulgar Zweig from Astra Lost in Space. This guy can even excel in portraying antagonists characters such as Tomura from My Hero Academia, Meruem from Hunter x Hunter, and Midnight from Fairy Tale. In short, Koki Ichimiya is just amazing. He has been chasing his voice acting dream since 2007 and is currently at the sweet age of 30. <laughs> Up on number 2 is Kaito Ishikawa. <laughs> You've probably been waiting for Tobio Kageyama's voice actor, weren't you? Well, Kaito Ishikawa is certainly worth the wait. If it's some good-ass voice acting that you're looking for, then Kaito Ishikawa got you covered. Because if you certainly loved voices from Genos from One Punch Man or Sakuta from Bunny Girl Senpai, then you'll love Kaito Ishikawa. He has voiced a ton of characters that we all know and love. He's also one of the best in supporting roles in animes and some main roles too. He has also one voice acting awards on top of all that, Kaito Ishikawa is a truly remarkable voice actor ever since 2010 and believe it or not, he is currently 27 years old. Finally, on number 1, Murase Ayumu. <laughs> We've reached the end of the barrel with Hinata Shoyo's voice actor, who is male, yes. Murasa Ayumu is a trap, and <laughs> just kidding. But still, keep that in mind. Murasa Ayumu has been a consistent work of art, and with a cute voice like that, there's no doubt that he has done some memorable voice acting roles, like Joseph from Ancient Magus Bride, Shinichi from Sword Art Online, and even Iruma from the Welcome to Demon School anime. Murasa Ayumu's voice has quite the quirk that catches everyone's heart, especially for Hinata fans out there, he can also speak English well. He's currently 32 years old and has been voice acting child characters since 2012. Well, well, thanks for reaching the end of the video. Don't be sad. If you didn't see your favorite character or voiceover in here, we'll certainly add them in the next one. Now, enough of that. We now have shared with you the voiceovers of your favorite Haikyuu characters. We hope that you liked this video, and if you've got something to say, then we would happily receive them in the comment section below. And if you like this content, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new here, since it helps us continue making these lists. And if you want to see more, then click the notification bell to not miss out on any of these entries. Now, thanks again for watching the video, and have a beautiful day.